Hi, this is Nan Juan, Mile High Sports Guru, reporting for Bronco Planet. We just finished the 2012 draft, and it's time to give Elway and the Broncos brass some grades. Yay! With the 36th selection in the 2012 draft, the Broncos select defensive tackle Derek Wolf. Oh, well, that's weird. I didn't have him on my sheet. Oh, well, he's over 300 pounds, is faster than Nosha Marino, and can power lift your house. Overall grade, B, as in beef, it's what's for dinner. With the 57th selection of the 2012 draft, the Broncos pick choice power forward Brock Osweiler, QB from ASU. Oh, I guess the Broncos want to be like the Nuggets with this pick. Seriously, a 6'8 quarterback? At least he will lead the league in rebounding. On a positive note, he stays in the pocket, can throw a spiral, and doesn't have annoying followers like Tim Tebow. For that alone, I'm giving him an A. With the 67th selection in the 2012 draft, the Broncos chose running back Ronnie Hillman. Now that's what I'm talking about. Speedy, quick, and can catch the ball out of the backfield. I also like that he is from San Diego State, which is just a few miles in fences from my hometown of Tijuana. Final grade, B. Now go teach Willis McGahee how to catch. And for the 101st pick in the 2012 draft, the Broncos select Omar Bolden, also known as ER. In 2011, Omar spent more time in the hospital than he did on the football field. Did you know that Omar was once considered a first-round pick? <laughs> well, this much we know for sure. If Omar gets healthy, it'll be lights out for Phillip Rivers and others in the AFC West. This was a wise investment for John Elway and company. High risk, but high potential for wimpy knees Bolden. Grade, eh, C+, but with room to grow. And next on the board, at pick number 108, the Broncos select Phillip Blake, center from Baylor. Wow, that's original. Another center from Baylor. Blake is a versatile player who can fill in for center or guard. After watching guard Chris Cooper's foot get twisted up like a churro last season, this was a much-needed insurance policy for the young Broncos line. B+. And with the 137th pick in the 2012 draft, the Broncos select Malik Jackson. Ugh. As if one ineffective defensive lineman from Tennessee isn't enough. The Broncos now have four volunteers on the team, including Peyton Manning, Britton Colquitt, Robert Ayers, and now Malik Jackson. Might as well pop open some tequila and start singing Rocky Top. Rocky Top, you'll always be home sweet home to me. Good old Rocky Top, Rocky Top, Tennessee. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please, no applause, no applause. Grade C. And finally, three days later, with the 188th pick in the 2012 draft, the Broncos select Danny Trevathan. Now there's a pick that makes sense. With DJ Williams allegedly popping horse pills and goat's butt cheese, the Broncos need a fast, hard-hitting linebacker to cover all of his suspensions. I give this pick a strong B, but willing to move it to an A if he also signs up to be DJ's designated driver. Well, that ought to do it, folks. No need to run to the mailbox to hide this report card. The overall GPA for EFX in the Broncos is a 3.0, and not too shabby. On behalf of Bronco Planet, and until next time, this is Nan Juan asking you to drive safe, don't get a personalized license plate that reads sauced, and may a hungry gopher never nibble at your nuts. Peace out.